Hi everybody. Today what I want to do is uh, demonstrate this new cartridge puller uh, from Slim Jim Tools and um, they manufacture all their own tools right here in the USA. If you want more information you could go to slimjimtools.com and they'll give you more information on it. Anyway it's a beautiful tool, extremely well made. Nice, it's a nice heavy tool. Staying here lasts your lifetime. But what it does is it pulls off the 13 and 1400 series cartridges from Delta shower or tub valves, just like this one right here. Got a kind of a slate, you know, tapered uh, front nose piece. But also, it pulls out the older style and the newer style. You can see the white one and the gray one. This is an RP19804. And, uh, You'll see the different both this this tool here will pull both of those cartridges out. So anyway, <clears throat> how you use this tool is you're going to just run it up there just like that in that position, and then what you're going to do is you're going to take your tabs, pull your tabs back like that. And what happens is is that when you screw this on, there's threads in here, and they're going to thread onto that valve body. And by threading onto the valve body. It's not going to torque anything, you know, or anything else. Because most of the time before, what happened is, is that, you know, technicians, <clears throat> in which we use these in all our trucks. We've been doing this for 46 years, so I mean, but anyway, <clears throat> we use these tools a lot. So anyway, <clears throat> what happens is a lot of times before uh, they would take and try to twist this, and then start pulling on it try to get it out because back in here in the valve body there's another tumbler that has ports in the back side and they get they weep a little bit of water they get stuck and corroded and everything else and then it's just a pain in the neck but anyway what happens is a lot of times when they're difficult to take out this gets <coughs> um, separated by cracking between the two and um, it's just this part comes out and the other part stays in there. But this thing here is going to put equal pressure all the way around. So, anyway, <clears throat> just screw it on just like that. Okay, just like that. And you're going to make sure that, you know, this is going to slide all the way up. You can actually see where it bumps up against the uh, the cartridge flange so you're going to just tighten that down like that and then we're going to just start unscrewing that and uh, we'll just pull that cartridge right out of there and it just pulls the whole cartridge right out and a nice equal pressure that's balanced all the way you know 360 degrees all the way around that retaining ring so which makes it nice and easy. So that's basically what you do. <clears throat> and you're just going to unscrew it from the valve. And you're just going to pull it out just like that. And uh, just run that back up there just like that. You'll be ready for the next one. Just unscrew your top <coughs> thumb screws, and that's what you got. You just pull it right out. But a lot of times, <clears throat> just like I said before, this area right in here where these O-rings are, sometimes they weep a little bit of water and, uh, you know, the seals, and this just gets all corroded back up in here, and uh, then you can't take it apart. So what happens is it winds up breaking off the retaining ring here, and I tell you what, some of these can be a challenge to get out when they're like that. But with this tool right here, it applies even pressure, you know, all the way around that <clears throat> so that uh, it comes out nice and smooth. Put your new uh, cartridge in and you're good to go. But anyway, I would just thank Slim Jim Tools for allowing us to, uh, you know, test all their tools. Uh, they have a lot of different tools uh, some of them are not on the market today, but they will be. But um, we we take and put them through quite a quite of uh, a workout. So anyway, 
Thank you very much, and we'll see you on the next tool.